Hi, I'm Tom Stewart, and right now it's my great pleasure to welcome back to television Susan Stroman, director, uh, choreographer, uh, multi-Tony Award winner, incredible talent. I hope that before this is over, you're going to teach me to dance. But, <laughs> but in this space, I don't think it's going to happen. Well, we could probably get a little uh, shim-sham in this space. Okay, we'll, we work, together, we'll, we'll yes. work on that. <laughs> uh, but, you know, no stranger to public television, I just wanted to point out Contact, uh, yes. which was on Live from Lincoln Center, yes. uh, also an Emmy Award-winning production, a Tony yes. Award-winning production. Uh, I keep singing Simply Irresistible, <laughs> just uh, thinking about that show. Well, thank you. That, was, that show was very special to all of us, really uh, close to our hearts. It was a dance play, as I recall. Yes, it, it yes. Was, it was uh, all kinds of different music, and, and great and, cast. And different choreography, and yeah, the cast with Boyd Gaines and Karen Ziemba and Deborah Yates. And it was a very special company. And actually, everybody has stayed very close since that production. A bonding experience. Yes, it was and who, very much a bonding And, and who's, the, who's the gentleman with the eyes? Oh, yeah. The, uh, the, the bartender. Oh, Jason, I know. He's, he's wonderful. He's, he's moved to Los Angeles, though, and, and we okay. see him in many All movies right. now. But that's the past. The present is Big Fish <laughs> yes. on Broadway. And I'm not really familiar with the, the, the whole premise of Big Fish. Could you tell me a little bit about what Big Fish means? Well, Big Fish uh, is about uh, someone who tells big fish stories. Yeah. And in, in our case of our play, uh, our lead character, Edward Bloom, tells big fish stories. And he's known for it and loves it. And, and with this concept and idea, we create these big fish stories in front of the audience. As the show unfolds, uh, he has a son who is about to have a son of his own, and he wants to find out if these big fish stories are true or not. Mm -hmm. And uh, so even the audience wants to know <clears throat> by the end of the show if those stories are true or not. Okay. So it, it is, I think, for all of us in the theater or who create for the theater or love the theater, it has an accessibility to it because we all are here because someone told us big fish stories right. in our well, lifetime. Well, I read that your own dad was uh, yes. sort of a big fish character. Yes, he told big fish so, tales all the him. time. Well, he, you know, he was a salesman like Edward Bloom, and he, he told big fish stories. And, and to this day, he's gone now, but to this day, I wonder how many of them were actually true. But they certainly made for great conversation around the Thanksgiving table. And you started your choreographing right uh, in the living room at oh, home? Oh, sure. Uh, yeah, he, he was a wonderful piano player, and I, would, I was that little girl that danced around the living room to her father playing the piano. Did you always know you wanted to be the choreographer rather than the performer? I knew oh, that you yes. were a performer. No, but uh, creating for the theater, creating dance, um, I have a great passion for music and, and being part of creating something and, and being, being a storyteller is um, very special to me and I, I uh, always wanted to do that ever since I was a little girl. Now, now this story, uh, again, Norbert Leo Butts is the star, whom we've seen Tony Award winner for several yes. shows on Broadway. Yes. Uh, so he plays a dual role, in essence? Yes, he plays uh, the older Edward Bloom, and then in some of these flashbacks, the younger Edward Bloom. So we see him in his youth. And uh, Norbert was born to play this part because he is authentically Southern, uh -huh. and he has children. He is a father, a devoted father. And he also is a big fish storyteller. So this, this part, uh, it was meant to be. Perfect It casting. really was meant to be, yes. And, you know, I, I like to keep repeating the name Norbert Leo Buzz, because <laughs> that's a name that everyone should know. I know. That, that does not know this name, because he is well, such he an is, amazingly talented And man. he's one of a kind, you know. And uh, in this business, that's what you search for, one of a kind. And he is that. And he is a great leader of the company. And Kate Baldwin, a beautiful actress and Beautiful singer. Kate Baldwin, yes. And I think one of our greatest singers in in the Broadway community but she also well, up on stage she looks like uh, a movie star mm -hmm. you know she looks like Rita Hayworth has or something that radiance gorgeous about her. she has a radiance about her and she also plays older Sandra and younger Sandra you see when they first meet and then you see them as a, a loving couple together in in their later years but not all actors can really do that but but Kate and Norbert have the ability to go back and forth and I think for them 
uh, to take that journey in a musical uh, is, is very rare to play all these different ages. So they, they've, they've really seized the moment and done a beautiful job. And there's a wonderful young actor that I know of whom I've seen in other things, Bobby Steggert. Uh, what yes. does Bobby play? Bobby, you know, uh, Bobby was actually, when I did A Christmas Carol at Madison Square Garden, he was one of my little... <laughs> oh. He was one of my Ebenezer Scrooge at 12, I think. So he was a, a young man in, in uh, A Christmas Carol, and uh, now, now he's a big Broadway star. He, he reminded me of that on the first day of rehearsal. So that things he, are, are settled in? Is, is the play done? Yes, is yes. the play ready for... Uh, yes, we uh, are ready. We, we froze the show this weekend, and uh, we open on Sunday, and that's uh, very exciting. Now the cast, uh, the spirits are very high. And I should just point out, it's at the Neil Simon Theater. Yes, the Neil West Simon. West 52nd Street in, in New York City. Yes. Tickets available through all purveyors of tickets. <laughs> yes, uh, yes, absolutely. Okay, okay. Well, Susan, it's a wonderful uh, personal experience and professional experience to be able to talk with you today. Oh, thank you. I'm and, pleased uh, to be as here. as they say, break a leg. Thank you. Thank you very much.